Hey folks, it's Barry here. Welcome to my Virgin Kitchen. Say hello, Chloe, at the camera. Uh, Chloe is going to try a mini food. It's a mini food today. We're doing mini pancakes. Loads of you guys have been asking for this and it's got to go on this teeny little plate, right, mate? Yeah. It's a little bear plate. So we're going to put it on there. Mini Well, it is kind of like a rip-off mini the poo, yeah. So we're going to make the mini pancakes. I've got all the ingredients behind me. Oh, let's do it. Okay then folks, so to make our pancake batter, you could normally get a mixing bowl and add it all in one at a time, beating it together. But if you've got a little blender like this, you can chuck it all in in one go. And let's just do that right now. Uh, in goes the beaten egg, salt, sugar, vanilla, milk, plain flour. <laughs> yep, Chloe, I don't know if you can hear in the background, just going, yep, just chicken them off the ingredients, all right. And last but not least, this little pot of melted butter right there. All on there. Let's whiz it up. Amazing. That is looking batalicious. Let's check it inside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you excited for pancakes? Okay, excited pancake face. Okay, then, folks, my pan is nice and hot. I literally have a teaspoon of the batter. I'm just going to do a little circle uh, like this. So just to show you guys, I haven't used any oil in this pan, but that is non-stick. So if you want to use butter or oil, you can to help you get it up. You can see these teeny little bubbles appearing just here and here. A few more like that, and it's ready to flip. I've just try to change the angle slightly so you can see that just like large pancakes, it should have risen. Well, it has risen. There we go. <laughs> brown one side. Let's brown the other side, which is probably going to be the money shot. So I'll get that done, and we'll see it on some kitchen towel. Folks, it's fair to say for that second half, I upped my game and it is looking amazing uh, right there. Uh, just to show you, I think uh, the fake Winnie the Pooh will be happy about that. Making more batches now, so I'm going to get a good old stack. But also, here's a clip of me making some mini bacon to go with our mini pancake stack. Here we go then, folks. So the plate is ready to receive the pancakes. There goes the first one. Here goes the second one. You get the general idea. Let's stack them high. There we go. That will do. The last one on top. Let's put our little bacon on there. It's really crazy cooking up that small amount of bacon. The smell was incredible in here. And there it goes, the maple syrup all down it. Oh my gosh, I want to just pour it all over on there. I think Chloe might like this. If not, I'm eating it. And just for size comparison before we do get our thoughts, that is a standard size strawberry against it. Amazing times. Wave at yourself, Chloe. Can you see yourself? All right, uh, so this is your lunch, dinner, breakfast, whatever you want to call it. What is it? Pancake, yeah, that's very clever. Uh, do you want to have a go? To have a little taste? Shove more in your mouth? No, don't lick it, it's not an ice lolly. You just lick the bacon. She's a bacon girl, I love it. Oh my god, that very spicy. <laughs> I don't know if you heard that, she, oh my gosh, it's really spicy. It's only bacon, she calls salt spicy, but yeah. It's very tasty now. Very tasty now. Do you like it? Can you say what it tastes like to everyone? Um, very nice. Very nice. It tastes, any other words to describe it? It smells, I'm gonna finish this actually. Oh my gosh. Can you say stonker? Stonker. Stonker. There we go then guys, so that's our mini food all done. That tastes so, so good. Keep the mini food suggestions coming in and check out the mini food playlist if you haven't already. Can you say bye? Bye. You want the last one? Yeah. See you.